Hello, I'm Wade, and my wife Kim and I are starting up a new YouTube channel called KW1 Adventures. And we'd like to share with you our outings, day trips, vacations, and a little bit of cooking in between. And today's adventure will lead us through Getzendaner Park where we're going to explore the trails throughout Waxahachie. And we're gonna take you with us. We usually get started pretty early, especially in the summertime. It's supposed to be about 105 today. At Getzendaner Park and the trails, there are so many things to do. The park alone is family friendly. There are swings, picnic areas, and all kinds of things. And aside from the park, there are miles and miles of trails and walkways. Getting up with Wade is always enjoyable. We always enjoy our time outdoors and having these e-bikes have really helped me. I have joint issues and surgeries, multiple surgeries on a knee and have another one coming up, and this is the only way I can exercise. This trail is very enjoyable. It's so scenic around every turn. There's so much to see and enjoy. We can come out here multiple times and just see something different. And I remember crossing this bridge and seeing something I hadn't seen before. And it, it just makes it so exciting and get out into nature. One of the things that I like most about this trail is that the fact that it goes alongside Waxahachie Creek, and I really enjoy the sceneries and certain spots and uh, just a lot to see along the way. This journey can certainly be an epic adventure to say the least. This is one of my favorite parts of the creek. There's a trail that goes along beside it. And of course the walkway is right up here. But of all the things to do on Getzendaner Trail, one of my absolute favorites is fishing. I take a little ultralight rod and reel with me that folds up to about a foot long and I put it in a backpack and I'm able to stop along the way these holes and fish. It's places like this that one can escape the realities of everyday life and wander into many adventures. And though I didn't catch any fish at this hole today, I did manage to hang this small bass. He just got off the hook. That's part of the trail right there, headed back towards Getzenbainer. There's a little basketball park right here that many enjoy throughout the day. And this is about the halfway mark of this trail, right here into the downtown area. It's a coffee shop right there, feed store behind it, some old downtown places back there. And this is really cool here, this old bridge. I think there's a lot of history here.
We're sitting on this old trestle right here and I really would like to see the city of Waxahachie or somebody fix this thing up where the bikes can go across it. That would be really neat. This thing goes a long way across there and it would really add more adventure to this trail. I wouldn't think it would cost that much to put some plywood or something, something you can ride across there. Right off the walkway is Waxahachie Dog Park, which seems to be a big hit with the city. And right behind that is the farmer's market, one of our absolute favorites. And I'm always amazed at how quickly you can transform one minute from being in town to the next being completely in the country. But we've had a really good time this morning and it's starting to get a little warm now, so we're headed. We're headed back to the house. Well, I don't know how many miles we've gone, but we have gone a long way. Okay, we're back home now. We've done the trail. We've come home, taken showers, had breakfast, and we're gonna stay in here where it's nice and cool. And we just wanna encourage you to, if you've never been on this trail before, 